The Phase 1 of the Working with Women project started with the mission to testify that investing in workers' sexual and reproductive and health rights can bring business benefits to the garment sector. For the past four years since 2014, we implemented 10 inclusive business models in 20 garment factories. We facilitated collaboration, built capacity and partnerships to create self-sustaining SRHR solutions that are beneficial for businesses and workers. Counseling is a good thing. It 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 is a good ফ্যাক্টরিতে যে সব ওয়ার্কার আছে তারা বিভিন্ন রকম সমস্যা নিয়ে আমার কাছে আসে এরকম বাংলাদেশের প্রত্যেকটা ফ্যাক্টরিতে এই প্যারা কাউন্সিলিংটা খুবই একটি গুরুত্বপূর্ণ দরকার आवर সিস্টার্স আর হ্যাভিং অল দ্য ফ্যাসিলিটিস অফ এসএনবি এন্ড এসআরএইচআর रिलेटेड সার্ভিসেস শ্রমিকরা যখন আগে বেতনের জন্য অপেক্ষা করতে হতো বেতন পাওয়ার পরে সে সেবা নিতে এখন তার এই অপেক্ষাটা করতে হচ্ছে না but lack of sustainable SRHR services and products for workers still remains a huge challenge. Having evidenced the business benefit, SNV is introducing the Phase 2 of Working with Women project to set the stage for supporting the garment sector in complying with workplace policies on SRHR and health through applying inclusive business models. Inclusive business is about designing and implementing commercially viable business solutions for the benefit of beneficiaries. In the next phase of this project, we'll be focusing on the development of three business models working in 10 different factories. These are models that are focusing on generating evidence to demonstrate the impact of such inclusive business models in this sector. Over the next four years, three inclusive business models focusing on three crucial areas will be implemented in 10 garment factories for potential expansion across the sector. Our Power Plus model is specially designed to address gender-based violence in the garment sector. Training and practical guidance will be provided to mid-level factory staff to make the workplace safer Factory welfare officers will be trained on psychosocial counseling to help the workers in reporting gender-based violence and also provide mental support. The health insurance model will facilitate collaborations between insurance companies, health service providers and garment factories to introduce health insurance for workers. This is a smart financing mechanism for comprehensive health care for garment workers. Menstrual hygiene management is an important part of our SRHR intervention. This business model will set out a holistic approach, starting from changing the behavior of workers, promoting hygiene practices, ensuring sanitary pads at workplace, and building factory capacity to address menstrual hygiene management through a basket solution. Sustainability is at the core of our inclusive business models. Investing in worker health is more than a social responsibility, and the business benefits are proven. Every stakeholder in the RMG value chain has an important role to play to make this happen. There are many factories have already joined with this program, and I'm requesting all our uh, BGU members and also from uh, Dutch Chamber. We have a bilateral chamber of a Dutch Chamber. Uh, the member uh, should join this thing and take care of their employees and if we can take care of our employees properly and uh, it will be beneficiary for both of us. Change cannot take place in isolation. We believe expanding the inclusive business models in new factories and spreading the message of responsible business across the garment sector will make a big difference in the life of the garment workers.